Hello everybody, my name is Steven and I am not a vlogger and um, what am I supposed to do to vlog? Just tell them what I'm thinking? Okay, what am I thinking? I'm thinking, who the hell am I talking to? There's nobody there. This is my video of my day that I'm going to vlog to you. So I've just woke up and my wake up time every day is 9.20, uh, which is a very important time. And I always know uh, when I wake up if it's 9.20 by uh, looking at this watch. So I'll tell you guys the secret of a big breakfast. The trick is, this is if you're uh, counting your calories and you want to do good. The trick is not to actually have a big breakfast, but to have whatever size breakfast and a small spoon. That way your mind will think that you're having three times as much bites but really it's smaller bites and your mind just doesn't know any different. Serious. So all the celebrities do it. Voted number one calorie counting technique 2015. Invented by me. Small spoon, small breakfast. Low calorie. Next thing I like to do is just stand and stare into the mirror and think positive thoughts. Today you're gonna be happy! You do not need to lose weight! You are a pretty girl! But I am a, a vlogger now, so I guess I could just uh, stare at the camera instead, like all the vloggers do. What? Oh! Bad boy! A lot of people say cats are scared of bananas. Um, I don't think that's true. Now that my exams are over, I'm free to do whatever I want. Today, I'm gonna cycle on my new bike. It's beautiful, isn't it? It's beautiful. Then I'm going to go to the gym. Yeah. Exciting, exciting life of a vlogger. You've got to always make sure you've got to correct, uh, clothing and protective gear for cycling. So what you want to do is, is take your helmet, you can uh, twist it to adjust things in the back and you want to just set that aside uh, and put on your, um, I don't actually know what this is called, but Amazon for ADP, it's great. So you just want to put on your skull mask thing and this will stop you from eating flies uh, because what happens is the flies go into the portal of Excalibur's mouth and get transported to another dimension. So, yeah, you always you always want to make sure you uh, wear the, the right gear for cycling. If you want to, you uh, you can wear a helmet. This isn't actually mine. I don't wear a helmet myself because it cramps my style. So, don't try this at home. The next uh, piece of protective bike gear you want to wear is these shorts. And uh, I really think these should be made legal to wear, so. I think anyone should be arrested if they don't wear uh, these protective shorts for cycling. And again, off Amazon. Yeah, let me just, let me just show you. So, protective only, you know, and the front. And these just give you a really good pattern for your seat so that, um, so you don't get raped by your bike. Because nobody wants to get raped. And some people like to um, say that if you wear provocative, provocative, provocative uh, clothes, that you're gonna get raped. And these people are just insane. Just because we wear skimpy clothes, 
does not mean we deserve to get raped by our bikes. So that's why we even, we've come up with these shorts. And these just, uh, these just mean that we can wear skimpy shorts, but not get raped by our bikes. You can't keep a bike outside, and then you gotta keep it in the flat because um, I live in Manchester and they all get stolen. This is the end of part one. Don't want to make it more than f six minutes. Click somewhere for part two. Somewhere. Not, not on the screen. No. No. Somewhere. Just, just click it!